Today I'm going to talk about the new version of Synopsis for Variety Versus Plugin. There are two important updates in this version. It enables you to use a secret file type authentication key for improved security instead of username and password for Coverity Connect. And it enables you to view analysis summary from Coverity Connect in your Jenkins. Let's jump to the demo. To update to the latest release in your Jenkins instance, go to Manage Jenkins and then go to Manage Plugins. If you have not already updated, the new version should show up in the Update tab, which you can select and update. If you have, you can see the version in the Install tab. Here I have updated to the latest version 2.4.0. Now let's look at using authentication keys first. From your Coverity Connect browser, you can download authentication keys by going into top right corner, admin user drop down menu, and selecting authentication keys. A new window will pop up where you can give a name to your key and download. Then, in your Jenkins window, go to Manage Jenkins and then Configure System. There, in Synopsis Coverity section, you have your Coverity Connect URL, and for credentials, you can use either username password or the authentication keys. To use authentication keys, select Jenkins from the Add menu. It will open up a Jenkins Credentials Provider window. Here in the Kind menu, select Secret File option, and then in the file option, browse and add the Coverity Connect authentication keys you just downloaded. Then click Add, and you can then test the connection. Now let's go back to Jenkins main page to learn how to configure Coverity Connect analysis summary. Let's go through enabling this for a freestyle project. This is my freestyle project. We first select the Configure tab from the sidebar. In the build environment, I have Coverity injected into the build process. And then below that, there are build options to execute Coverity static analysis. In this new version, there is a new Check for Issues option. To enable viewing analysis summary in Jenkins, select this option. It shows two new options. Select the Coverity view summary you want in Jenkins, and then choose the build status and save the configuration. Then onward, when your new build is completed, you will see the Coverity analysis summary in the sidebar for your build. When you click on it, it will take you to the Coverity Connect portal to show the uh, defects Coverity found. Similarly, for a pipeline project, when you configure pipe, your pipeline to inject Coverity, you will need to add an extra step Coverity issue check within your Coverity environment command. You can use pipeline syntax helper to generate the correct syntax for this setup, then save the option, and then onwards when your build, new build is completed, you will see the Coverity analysis summary in the sidebar for your build. That's it for now. Thank you.